So a new thing we discovered tonight is that the microwave is on the fritz. I'm going to start it here and we'll just see what happens. There's uh, nothing in it. So it completely flips off after about three seconds. It starts again by itself. The clock doesn't reset. Timer doesn't reset. Just uh, loses the under lights, the, uh, the down lights here. It sounds like the magnetron turns off too. I'll try it again. Well, now that it's warmed up, it's going to work, but it, it's making a little bit of a racket up here, which is atypical. So what I've read is that the hypothesis is there's something wrong with the magnetron, and it's actually leaking EMI, electromagnetic interference, into the control panel over here, and that is actually uh, messing up with... Uh, the controller's ability to turn the magnetron on and off and, and so on. So what people have recommended is if you actually take this panel off, lean it forward 45 degrees and just live with it off, uh, you know, hanging off, that it'll work because it gives it enough distance for that electromagnetic interference to not mess with the controller. Uh, the other solution people have talked about is to take this off and slip a piece of aluminum foil, which is less recommended, or one of those anti-static bags you get, say when you purchase a computer part, they look like um, kind of silvery gray uh, Ziploc bags. Slip that into there, and then you can put this back on, and that shields the controller from the interference. So let me reset this and try one more time and see if we can reproduce it, but um, it's been doing that only today I started doing this. So I'm going to do it again now that it's warmed up. So I wonder if there's something to do with that as well the first time that Magnetron kicks on. But there's quite a bit of noise uh, coming from right behind here, which is, yeah, a little, a little worrisome too. I don't want to be getting bombarded with radiation from my microwave. Anyway, that's what's going on. We'll see if we can get it fixed.